Well, Diego's eight. And his favourite things that he loves doing is anything to do with like Lego or just building, things like that. Some of the challenges that I feel that we face is definitely just the, the anxiety levels that Diego has when he's around large numbers of people. Things like eating. Textures, smells. Brushing of teeth. Um, now that was just wouldn't happen. Things that we take for granted can be overwhelming for Diego, which is a, a, a common trait of, of autism. Diego's behaviour since being a part of North Cod and working with them has dramatically changed. Our life as a family has changed. Little things along the way was just helping find out why he was melting down and how we could overcome that. If I was going food shopping, obviously Diego just wouldn't come. So we sort of had to take that focus off everything that he was focusing on and just bring it back to, okay, we're here for just a quick trip. We'll write a list out and you can help mummy do the list. And that worked mm. a treat. Oh my God, that was the first time that we honestly could go mm. food shopping. So little things like that had made a huge difference. Basically, we're a really active family. We love being outdoors. One of the things that we really enjoy doing is bike riding. That's just, that's our love because it's something that we all enjoy. And it was, it, it was a trial and error for him to, to want to learn and to get him to learn to re ride the bike. But essentially what had happened when he started to learn, um, that opened up a whole new um, area for something for us to do on the weekends um, and that really um, made a big difference too when we all come back as a family it was like wow we all went out together the greatest attribute that I, I think has come from Northcott is that Diego's quality in life has actually dramatically changed which at the end of the day I think that's the most important thing and Northcott has certainly done that